This is Richard Allen at the University of Iowa. This video demonstrates a conjunctival biopsy. This patient has a history of idiopathic cicatricial changes and specimens for both histopathology and immunopathology are being taken. The palpebral conjunctiva is exposed and a specimen is taken from the area between the inferior border of the tarsus and the fornix. This biopsy can be taken with tooth forceps and Westcott scissors. The specimen is then placed on filter paper so that it remains flat with the orientation of the specimen with the epithelium up. This is the histopathology specimen which will be placed in formalin. An additional specimen is then taken in the same manner with placement on filter paper. This specimen will be sent for immunopathology and will be placed in saline soaked gauze. This specimen needs to be sent immediately to the lab for evaluation. Hemostasis is obtained with the bipolar cautery. These sites do not need to be closed with suture. Antibiotic ointment is used three times per day.